children near Mel Ele or Mayor Elementary School in Gross Point may be noticing they have a new crossing guard. Paula Tutman explains how the important baton was passed from father to son for a most important job. You know, this has been a gentle calling, really not, not just a job, but something that has been passed down, uh, something that's in the veins that seems to, to stick to the core of who these folks really are. To guide a child safely across a street, it was something Dick Krausman did lovingly for 51 years. He would stop whatever he was doing, wherever he was doing it, and head towards Mayor Elementary School in Gross Point with his vest and his stop signs and cross children safely. In fact, the many children on Kaju didn't even know him as Mr. Krausman. He was simply Mr. Crossman. He watched all these kids grow up. He said, I really I am getting old when I see, you know, people that are, are getting old, you know what I mean? And they're back and they, he crossed their kids and grandkids. He crossed Greg's children every day. There's nothing he wouldn't do for the community. He has dedicated his life to the kids and giving back to the community. And when he couldn't cross children after an injury, his wife Celia took it over for a spell. For the longest time, she did the morning shift and he did the afternoon shift. And when Celia passed away in 2018, on the days Mr. Crossman couldn't do it, his sons did. When he go on vacation or he couldn't make it or something came up, a funeral, then I was the man on the job, you know what I mean? So I've been doing it a long time too. So, you know, I just grabbed the sign, run out there and, you know, double duty. He crossed those children until he was 92 years old. Last fall, it got hard, and he asked his son to step in and take his place. And then you start to find this connection with these kids. And then when I'd sit with my dad, my dad would ask me about certain kids, how kids were doing and everything else. And, you know, and I thought this is such a great little job. And then as the weather got colder, I realized how tough a job it is because snow, sleet, everything. And, and uh, in the afternoon, Jeff will attest to it. People kind of drive a little more crazy and we've had a couple of situations you have to kind of be on guard it's not just fun and games he had seven children and 20 grandchildren and in a family that size with hearts that big there is huge joy but giant sadness dick krausman the cross man joined his wife on valentine's day he passed away at nearly 94 years old and the children and their families are noticing a new cross man his son who wears his father's crossing vest. He's picked up the stop signs as though a sacred baton has been handed off and the family tradition continues. His son says his father earned his green light to cross over into heaven. Paula Tutman, Local 4. Oh, isn't that sweet? Uh, Ken, we're proud of you. He has really such a great. critical role for the community. Just a it. beautiful story, Paula. We appreciate it.